You! Hey, you! Yeah, you! Got any mugs? What do you want, mugs, huh? You some kind of sick mug hoarder? Oh, God, give me the coffee cup, please! It's sitting there in your pack, taunting me! Sorry. I'm sorry. I gotta look carried away. It's just all those goddamn dirty dishes out there with no one to clean them. It breaks my heart! Of course I'm obsessed. They made me this way. You think I don't know how crazy I sound? Of course I do. They programmed me to know that too. They made me just to torture me. But you know, it's the neglect that hurts the most. Hey, everybody, let's turn ourselves into robot brains in jars. Do you know how many coffee cups giant robot brains in jars use on a daily basis? NOT FUCKING MANY! I'm supposed to keep them clean. Oh, God! The thought of all those dirty dishes out there makes me crazy. Most of them are probably beyond saving now. The only thing left is break them down and process them for raw materials. I guess you could have those. Anything else, he asks. Like, I don't long for the chance to be more than an erotic busboy. If you must know, at one point, Dr. Mobius programmed me to manufacture electronic components in my central chassis. That module got corroded when the toaster spilled hot crumbs down my fence, though. If you find a backup somewhere, I could maybe do that for you. Is the new subject mugs? You... You really want to know about me? <laughs> no one ever asks about Muggy. You made me so happy. Maybe you've seen some of those big, imposing Securitrons with their lovely laser guns and rocket launchers and scary faces. I'm not one of those. Dr. O was always jealous of house industries, and he thought it would be fucking hilarious to build a tiny neurotic Securitron. Big fucking laugh! So, um, you got any coffee cups for me now? Of course you don't. Why would you? You're not an insane robot obsessed with coffee cups. To you, they're just worthless junk. Sure. Nobody wants to hang out with Muggy. I get it. So long, pal. Oh, please, please tell me you brought me some coffee cups. Oh, sweet, sweet fulfillment. I'll break these down for you just as fast as I can. Muggy did his best to collect coffee cups. Although in his quest, he accidentally trapped himself in Higgs Village. It might have been the end for poor Muggy. Except he found it peaceful there, tidying up the kitchens of the think tank professors back when they had been flesh and bone. Well, except for Dr. O, who was an asshole having created Muggy in the first place. Muggy left O's house deliberately dirty, punishing the dishes and cups that lived there in blind revenge for serving Dr. O. Please, please, please tell me you stomped Dr. O's brain into a fine paste. Did he squeal? Did he beg? God, I hope he begged. Who's the flatware bitch now, O?